Hey guys, so before I get started on this video, um, I just want to say that right now there is a thunderstorm, so it's kind of loud, there's a lot of thunder, uh, there's lightning, but right now the dogs are outside and nobody else is home, so this is probably the only time I'm going to get to record this video, so I'm going to record it really quick and hope for the best, and we're just going to hope that the thunder stays quiet enough for me to record the voiceover, and if it doesn't, I'm sorry, but here we go. <laughs> Hey guys, today I'm going to make a Wii and some of the things that come with it. I didn't think I missed anything, but if I did, leave it below in the comments. Now let's start with the Wii itself. I cut out 18 pieces of cardboard. The dimensions on this one are really difficult to explain, but I'm going to try anyways. Um, at its longest point, it is 1 and 7 8 of an inch. At its highest point, it is 1 and 7 16 of an inch. At its shortest point, it is 1 and a half inches. At its lowest point, it is one and one fourth inches. That's really the best I can do on that. Keep in mind, this is designed for dolls like Monster High and Pinky Cooper, but you could make it bigger or smaller if needed. Cut out six pieces to cover this main piece, three for each side. Cut holes in three pieces. This hole is big enough to hold a DVD from a previous video. Glue them together and to one of the uncut pieces. Paint the disc tray. Glue an uncut piece on top. Keep gluing five on one side, ten on the other. Paint and design. Glue and paint the side pieces on. Paint on the power button. Cover and glue. And now let's move on to the sensor bar. Cut out four pieces of cardboard. The dimensions are one and a half inches by one fourth of an inch. Stack and glue together. Paint it. Cover it in glue. And let's move on to the Wii Remote. Cut out six pieces of cardboard. The dimensions are seven sixteenths of an inch by three eighths of an inch. Stack and glue them together. Paint. Pencil on the buttons. You can paint them, but I chose not to. Cover the whole thing with glue. Now let's move on to the nunchuck. Uh -huh, I didn't really have a great idea for the nunchuck, but this is about as good as it's going to get, so we're going to roll with it. First, I cut out six pieces of cardboard. For reference, they're the same width as the Wii Remote, but a little shorter. But really, they should actually be um, smaller in width and probably also smaller in length. Um, bend the pieces before gluing them together, and in the end, you want it to curve nicely. Paint it, glue a small bead on top and a bigger bead on the bottom. Fill the beads with glue and allow to dry. Paint the beads, cover the entire thing in glue, and you're done. Again, it's not the best thing, but it's the only thing I could come up with. It's a little big for the dolls, but it's really the best I could do. Uh, leave your suggestions down below, and I'll see what I can do. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now!